Welcome back to Free Play. This is the last episode for the showcase for Vindictus. So I think we're going to start off with the Supply Depot. I think this is the paid store, I believe. We'll find out once it opens. Yes, it is. So this is where you get your money. You use your real life money, essentially, because the NX coins is what you you are uh, by. And there's also try coins, don't know what they are. So, let's see. Package of the strength. Enhan so, enhancement stuff. Ooh, I don't like this extraction. So, basically, major help with crafting. Let's look at hot items. So, yeah. All of this stuff is purchased a lot. Marketplace license. Uh, pet food. So on. Um, battle. So there's pets, which increase your stats, equipment upgrades, allows you to uh, make an enhancement. Okay, scrolls permanent and so on. It's a PvP thing, which is a two times bonus, which is fine, I think. Skills, so you can max out your skills early. Ooh, I don't like that. And then resets and uh, allows you to generate more AP. Stats. What's this? A contract sealed. Right click to under seal coin if you. Uh, within the level range of the level restrictions. I have no idea what they are, but it seems like they're kind of badges for 30 days. Oh god, 7 days? No! Path change and all that has the power to alter the old pack. Okay. Ugh. Experience blessing. So these are passive stat boosts. So there's cosmetic stuff. Name changes and such. Makeovers and so on. Yeah. What happens if I hit purchase? Ah, uh, you need the tie. So, yeah. I, um... Their paid stuff is kind of bullshit. <laughs> it, 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 cause it gives you the sense of pay to win. It's, if you have these bonus stats over everyone, then you're gonna generate stuff. Or if, if you max out all your skills before someone who can viably do it. kind of diminishes. So we have something new. Activate. Okay. I assume what that is. I like how they have the little animations. So, uh, who we're talking to? Talking to you. Story. Um. Okay. And... So, we're just gonna play. Uh, my opinion of the game is, for me personally, I don't enjoy the character. I might have, that's just me choosing wrong. The archer doesn't feel that fun to play. Um, Leveling is okay, like we, we've got it into 20 plus in the time that we've played, so it's not that hard to level up. 
And yeah, so yeah, it's 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 okay. I just don't like the store that it has, and that's my biggest gripe with it. So, just quickly get depart. So yeah, I think we'll just do this quest, cash it in, and then we'll be done. So this episode's going to be a little bit shorter, but we did spend the first five minutes pretty much just talking about the game. Well, talking about its store. The mechanics are fine, I actually, they're quite interesting. Gonna get loud! <laughs> that didn't work. Uh, and we just had to move. Okay. It feels slow. That's the weirdest thing. The more that I play it, I feel like the progression is very slow, especially with load times. It just doesn't feel right.
Can't use them. Okay. Okay, working out ish. It's already open. Okay. Next zone. I honestly thought I could uh, get the execution on there for once, but I'm way too slow for that. Downside of being ranged, you have to get up close to do it. Okay. So we got 2,000, well, 3,000 gold pretty much. So, by the end of all this, we got to level 25, which I think maybe the cap is 100, so we got one-fourth of the way there, maybe, I don't know, I don't know what the cap is, so yeah. We can train a new skill, apparently. Hmm. 
Um, not that I can see. Okay, so we'll just go turn in this quest. So we have to go to mercenary. Okay. Actually, we got new boots. We got a crossbow. And this is where I'm going to end it. So this is going to be the end of this showcase for a free play series for Vindictus. Probably won't be going back to it at all. Unlike what I did with Eternal, where I said I was probably not going to play it, but I've played it a lot since then. <laughs> and that was mainly because of, um, it's something that I can have on the side while I'm watching something or and so on, or doing something else. Because I can just play Gauntlet over and over. So, yeah, um, in the comments below, let me know what you, um, what you think of the playthrough and any suggestions for the future any game suggestions or tips and tricks and so on anyway thank you guys for watching i'll see you next time